Donald Trump, I'm so glad that he won the four states he did the other day. That means that he's closer. He's only got 527 delegates that he needs to achieve in order to get the 1,200 plus delegates he needs to get the nomination. Hopefully he gets there. Uh, he's being optimistic about it. But it's going to be harder with Cruz staying in the race. And Cruz isn't going to get the delegates he needs because he's not going to get California. He's not going to get Newark. Those are two major uh, delegate states. And I don't think Cruz is going to get those. In Kasich staying in, some people are saying it's good because it takes delegates away from Cruz. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if I entirely trust Kasich, to be honest. So maybe Kasich should drop out. I don't know. I'd rather have Cruz drop out, personally, because uh, he's taking delegates away from Trump. And he doesn't want to work with Trump anyway, so uh, it's just a joke. And also McConnell. I'm so glad McConnell didn't bow down and nominate the, the person that Obama picked for Supreme Court Justice. The guy is anti-Second Amendment, and that is a nightmare. I'm so glad that McConnell stood his ground, and it's the first time he's done it in a long time, actually done something really good for the Republicans and people who believe in the Second Amendment. So congratulations, McConnell. You've taken the first step to not being a rhino for once. So um, I'm very happy, and I think McConnell did that as a favor to Trump because he's hoping Trump gets the nomination so that... Uh, Trump can pick the Supreme Court justice and we could win and get stuff we needed to get done. So congratulations, McConnell, on your non rhino ness today. And Trump for winning the nom not the nomination, I wish, but for Trump uh, winning the four states and getting those delegates that he desperately needed, especially Florida. Unfortunately, he didn't get Ohio. So, oh, well, you we just get California and New York. That's all you can do. All right. That's it. Hey! <laughs>